hi guys welcome back to another video in today's video i'm going to show you how to make this delicious mian coca and if you try this recipe i bet it will be one of your favorites so if you really want to know how i made this delicious finger licking and yummy soup keep on watching this video to the very end and make sure to subscribe to this channel and like this video so firstly i have my protein i am using beef and next i have some smoked fish shrimp powder salt fish powder african nutmeg i have coca which is made from baobab leaves and next i have locust beans known as dawa dawa some hot pepper seasoning cube and some onion so next in my pan i'll transfer my beef into it season it with the cube add salt to taste add some onions to it and then i'll cover it and allow it to cook for eight to ten minutes after that i'll come back and then give it a stir here i'll stir it very well for the seasoning and the salt to penetrate well into the meat then next i'll add my smoked fish i divided the fish into two because i want it to be well seasoned and then i'll add some water here add water to your consistency and next i'll add the powdered pepper and next i'll add the fish powder followed by the shrimp powder dawa dawa and next i'm going to roast my african nutmeg in order for my soup to be very tasty and the aroma to will draw your attention so after this i will then grind it after that i'll add it into my soup base and and this is how it looks so i'll add it to my soup base and then i'll stir it for everything to be well mixed i will then allow it to boil for 10 to 15 minutes till everything is well cooked if this is your first time of making me and coca make sure to save to your cooker because we have some particles in it and this will leave your soup to be so rough so you have to sift it for you to get the smooth powder so after sifting this is what i have so i'll continue with the sifting till i'm done with the cooker powder do you know aside the soup being very delicious the soup has loads of health benefits um the baobab leaves are rich in calcium potassium vitamin c and many more so if you've never tasted me and coca either do yourself or just see how the soup base is boiling so beautifully get yourself a zongo lady and thank me later so after 10 to 15 minutes it is time for us to add the coca so here if you don't have a whisk you can use your ladle and then be adding the coca bits by bits make sure not to add the coca at once if not your soup will be very lumpy just add the coca bits by bits then you use your whisk or your ladle and then do just the way i'm doing you can use this process as well so you are going to continue with this process till all the powder is finished or so you are okay with the consistency 
some people like their coca to be watery others like it in between and others too like it very heavy me i just like it in between so i will just do what i like so i will continue adding the powder till i'm okay with the consistency so just do what is good for you guys so i'll continue with this process till everything is well added <laughs> make sure to take your time during this process because we don't want any lamp in our soup because we want the soup to move smoothly please if you have watched this video to this end kindly subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet like this video because it's absolutely free <laughs> like this video to keep on motivating me to post more videos for you guys and make sure to turn on your notification bell to get you notified anytime i drop a new video and you can check on my channel for amazing videos as well so this is the consistency i want but if you want yours to be too thick you can add the powder and mind you once this cooker cools down it will taken up a little bit so be sure of that and make it a little bit lighter do you get what i mean <laughs> so guys this is our cooker after everything then you allow it to cook for about five to ten minutes more before you serve it just look at this cooker just tell me you don't want this cooker guys just get yourself a, a zongo lady or a lady from the north or you get yourself an ashant lady as well and let her watch this video and make you this delicious soup ever so with this soup you can pair it with rice balls even with rice and tuanzafi and oh my god the feeling is heavenly we normally call this cooker Mian Al Janna, meaning heaven soup. You can also garnish this cooker with palm oil. Try this recipe for your husband or your visitors, and they will love it. Thank you so so much for watching this video. See you in the next one. Bye bye.